Well, this is Auburn. Uh, as you can see, she's developing her cone slowly but surely. And uh, let's see where she could find her. There she is. She's slowly developing it. Developing it, excuse me. And there she is. And there's the silver lace, the buff, and the red star. And here is the New Ham. No, this is, excuse me. This is a uh, Delaware. Yeah. As you can tell, her feathers have. To me, they're fully developed. Not yet, though, but not fully developed. But well, this is them right here. This is them right at almost three months of age. And this is Auburn. <clears throat> By next month, she'll be six months old. I got her started on um, layer feed, which is gives them calcium because I think this is my theory I think they lose a little bit of calcium or lots of calcium when they lay eggs she's still technically a baby a couple more months and then she'll be ready to go she's not um, fully big yet she's gonna get a little bit bigger and her cone is gonna be much bigger as well as her, her waddle <clears throat> but here they are. There they are, right there. And, uh, I did a little something today. Today I, uh, decided to use a blender, out of all things, and basically break up all the food, all the chicken feed that I can find that's whole. What it is, I grinded it up instead. Save money and well, see. Still got some kernels right here, as you can tell. Some corn. So, there you go. And put that away for them so they don't pick at it and eat it all up. And of course, there they are. So, hopefully, you guys can enjoy the benefits the appreciation of keeping these beautiful birds, these chickens. Although I still think of them as chicks, because they are. <laughs> and in their water, you notice there's little spots there and stuff. I put a solution in there. It's like a, I guess it's like an antibiotic or something. And it keeps um, the water clean, and it breaks up all the algae that builds up in there, because that's not good for them. <clears throat> so, right now I've got them free range, right now they're just, just doing their thing, there's no point in keeping them caged up, and all they're going to do is eat and sleep and poop. Well, I mean, why do that? If you could just keep them out here for free, just keep them in the free, it's freedom, you know. The hard part is just keeping them away from the flowers at times, but uh, there's no problem with that. I, I don't mind um, helping out and keeping them away from the flowers. It's kind of a therapeutic thing for me. And of course, there they are. Let's see. Hey. What are you guys doing, huh? Well, I guess they're little gardeners. <coughs> Come on, little guys. Out. Out you go. Come on. But here they are. I hope you've enjoyed the video. Thanks.